and we're back to learning Inkscape and this time I'm going to show you how to create a world icon. Let us start with the ellipse tool, hold control and create a circle. We want to have no fill so click on the X and then hold shift and click on a black color swatch to give it a stroke. Now use the bezier tool, left click, hold control, left click again. It should be bigger than a circle. We've got the snapping enabled and snap to paths is active. Select both an object align and distribute and put it to the center. Now you can use the nodes tool and drag the nodes to the size of the circle. Hold control when you do. It should snap. We don't need this menu anymore. Let me put it to the center like this. Now press control D on the line. I click on it again and I hold control and rotate it. Again, press Ctrl D, this time use the notes tool. You've got this little hand icon and then you can drag a curvature. Something like this should be fine. Press Ctrl D again, then flip it with this function up here. Hold Ctrl when you drag it to the left and it should snap to the center. Once again, Ctrl D for the horizontal line. I'll use the nodes tool, resize it to the size of the circle and give it a curvature. Press Ctrl D once more and then flip it this time vertically and then drag it downwards while holding Ctrl, it snaps once more. You can create more and more of these lines if you want to, but most minimalist icons only have these. Go to object, fill and stroke and adjust the stroke style. Let me use pixels. And I go to 20, that's fine. If you've got problems with the join, so where these lines overlap, just play around with these functions up here. But it's fine for me. And this is how you can create such a world icon in Inkscape. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.